Hi everyone, please like and subscribe. Uh, so Dillian White has come out with the excuse that <laughs> Tyson Fury pushed him over and he banged his head on the canvas um, and that's what wrecked the fight for him. So he's not really giving Tyson the credit for the uppercut and he's saying that the uppercut only buzzed him and it was actually the push that <laughs> the push to the canvas that was the problem which I think is <laughs> if you're going to lose a fight take it like a man and um, just own up to it um, the uppercut definitely would have put him over I think Tyson Fury saved him from further punishment by pushing him but he was definitely going over um, so I don't know why he's come out with this excuse and he's saying um, that he he wasn't outclassed in the fight which he clearly was outclassed he looked as I thought he was slow on his feet and missing wildly with big shots but Tyson Fury can make anyone look bad but I mean Dillian White was never the quickest on his feet anyway um, but to say that he was in the fight is crazy he, was, he wasn't in the fight at all and to um, take the credit away from Tyson and uh, now Tyson Fury's um, saying he's going to retire but please leave a comment if you think that he should retire once he's become undisputed because I believe that he should fight the winner of AJ and Usyk which I think would be Usyk. And I think he should fight the winner and leave, retire, if he's if he's won, undefeated, undisputed, undefeated champion, because then that will cement his legacy. Um, if he leaves it without fighting the winner of that fight, I think it'll, it will leave a little... It'll just leave that thing out of it. It'll just leave that extra touch to being the undisputed champion. But please leave a comment if you think he should retire now or should he fight the winner of AJ Usyk. But thank you, everyone. All the best.